Okay guys, today I am going to be showing you, and, well not showing you, basically telling you how to make good quality gaming setups, gaming setup, gaming videos on, like on PS4 f with no money. Like zero dollars, zero, 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 and zero all the way out. So the way I record my videos is on PS4 there is a built in recording. As you see on your PS4 controller, there is share, as you can see over the left button. Just look. And if you double tap the share play, boom, boom, it starts recording. Top left corner, you'll see that it starts. It shows a clip with the red button. Now that means it'll start. It starts recording, and now you can do whatever you want with that video. But if you if you hit share one time, you'll see video settings, video and broadcast settings. You can say you're gonna click that, go video links, and you wanna make it as long as you want. Like I have mine set to 60 minutes, so that way I can make a video clip an hour long and then get rid of everything I don't want in that hour. But now the limit is an hour long, it's 60 minutes. But the way, if you want to stop your recording sooner than that, all you have to do is press share play once, and then go to video, go to the video clip, and they say save. And when you click the video clip, it'll say saved video clip, and you have to do that because if you don't, it won't save the video clip, and all that stuff was not saved, and you don't have the recording. Now you're probably wondering, but BML, Razer. How do you edit the video if you're wanting to do that with no money? Well, guess what, guys? PS4 is so awesome. PlayStation, Sony, and everything. Good group. Awesome group. They have a download for the PS4 download app. Share Factory for free. It, it, it is all the deluxe. This is how I'm basically editing this right now. Overlay. All, all The clip of this volume is zero. But then I have an overclip where I basically I am talking over the thing. And this Share Factory app is completely free, guys. And it's not for, like, a professional to be able to do this. I am not a professional at editing. And, and I'll get to the thumbnail part. And, um, it's really simple. You just press, like, it shows you what you can do. And it's for free. Like, you you can't you can't doubt that guys you have, you have to agree with that man I mean like come on like really no the thing when I record a video you have to have something to record now I was struggling right now I was making this clip I'm like man I don't know what to do I made like a hundred clips well not made them because I didn't save them so I was like recording a lot but I didn't save it and I don't have it and it, this is the one I have and yeah, and I was trying to think, man, what should I record? I'm like, wait, I want to make a gaming video, so maybe I should make a video about how I record my gaming on the PS4 for completely free. Now, right now, I am making this all in different clips, because if I don't, I'm literally going to be blah, blah, blahing, and I don't know what to say. So, it's really simple for me. This is all in one clip, and I'm basically sep stopping my recording. My, no, no, I'm not going to get to that part. But yeah, guys, now the thumbnail part, there's this thing about Share Factory. The thumbnail thing doesn't work. But the thing is, if you have a USB, it could be USB cord or USB um, little plugger, majigger thing, you can put that into your PS4. Go, mean, go to Gaming Captures and wait, wait, I need to tell you something else before we get that far. Now, the way to save a video clip is, like, I do my video screenshots, is I go in the game, I go in my, the clip I made in Share Factory, and I basically find the part that, you know, hit me the most in the game. Like, mainly Rainbow Six Siege, like, Frost Dead. I mean, man, that could, I actually didn't get that recording on there, on that recording, but it was a good recording, and it was pretty fun. The, I got, I came behind the frost, and I got him. All right, I'm getting off topic. Let's stay back to where we were. And, like, my first one, where you can't hide from me, the cavalry was trying to hide. I think it was the cavalry. Yeah, I'm, I'm not friends with cavalry. I don't like cavalry. Let me just, let me just state that out there, guys. Um,
But now, basically, you hit the share. You put the share button. You hit the share button on your controller, where you got the part where you want, and you hit it. Go to the photo one and hit save. Do save photo, and wait until it says save photo. Then you can go out of that. Go and then when you're done recording the video and then editing the video, you will share it by hitting the share. You'll see it on the right side. You'll do that and it'll render up. It does go all the way to 100%. So it depends on if you make a very long video, it's going to be a while, just like a few, maybe 30 minutes at least to when it's actually uploaded. And it takes a few minutes to upload to YouTube too as well. And, and for that to happen, it takes a while. So that gives you time to create your thumbnail. Now, when you're doing the thumbnail, you go to Share Factory after you're done recording the video and you'll see the photo editing one. Now, you're at the videoing editing now, but now you're going to the photo one. You can click that, import the, not import it, but select the, your image that you just shared, you just saved to your PS4, and then you're now going to edit that however you want. And that's how I do mine for in-game clips. And I am going to have an in-game clip right here as well, guys. And it's no, it's probably not going to be an in-game clip because it's not about the game. It's about to how to make a gaming video on PS4 for literally completely free. Zero, 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 zero. Like, there's not even any numbers.